hi here we have one more statement where we have to divide 64 into two parts in such a way that one part is three times the other right so if we assume one part part one as x right what will be part two part two will be 64 minus x and now let's read this again and see what actually the relation is see we have to divide 64 into two parts such that one part is three times the other that means the relation between these two parts x and 64 minus x is such that one is three times the another one right so if we assume that x is the smaller part 64 minus x will be three times x yes because 64 we have divided into two parts one is part one which is x and another one is part two which will be 64 minus x and the relation between them is such that one part is three times the another so if we assume the smaller part is x so 64 minus x which is the bigger part will be three times the smaller part which is x right yes so this will be the equation and if we rearrange it what will we get so if we add x both the sides we will get 64 is equal to 4x right and from here we will get x is equal to 64 by 4 this will be 4 ones are 4 4 6 are 24 so from here what we got we got x is equal to 16 right so this is the solution and this was the equation so one part will be 16 and another part will be x is 16 which is part 1 this is part 1 And what is part 2? Part 2 is 64 minus 16. And this will be 14 minus 6, which is 8. And 5 minus 1, which is 4. So part 1 is 16. And part 2 is 48. So 64 when divided into two parts of 16 and 48 we get this relation 48 here is three times the 16 right. So this is how we form the equation we read the statement carefully and then we write the relations properly and then when we solve it we get the solution right. So this was slightly tricky not very difficult you can see here we have reached the second step of making equations where we have to calculate and make the equations.